The 2030 Agenda for Sustainable Development, adopted by all United Nations member states in 2015, provides a shared blueprint for peace and prosperity for people in the planet, now and into the future. At its heart are the 17 Sustainable Development Goals, the SDGs, which are an urgent call for action by all countries in a global partnership. In adopting the 2030 Agenda for Sustainable Development, world leaders agreed that a global indicator framework was necessary to measure, monitor and report progress towards the SDGs. World leaders also called for public-private cooperation to broaden the range and uptake of Earth observation data and geospatial information. Earth observation provides a cost-effective way to monitor the Earth, providing a strong historical record, broad coverage and continuity into the future. Hence, they can prove essential in capturing the sustainability of developments underpinning the SDG framework. CIOS formed the SDG Ad Hoc Team in 2016, which was transformed in November 2021 to become a lighter coordinated approach led by the SEO and SIT Chair to streamline CIOS technical support for GEO and its objectives towards the 2030 Agenda. Over the five years, the Ad Hoc Team published several deliverables, including technical contributions to GEO documentation, for example the EO for 2030 Agenda report, accessible at eo42030agenda.com. The team also contributed to international reports and publications, including the special issue on SDGs in the Remote Sensing Environment Journal, and the publication of a special edition of the CEOS Earth Observation Handbook on SDGs, which can be found at eohandbook.com forward slash SDG. A key component of CIOS contributions to the SDG framework is the creation of Earth Observation Support Sheets, developed in collaboration with GEO communities and end users to outline current approaches and challenges for measuring a specific SDG indicator, as well as highlight potential areas for satellite Earth observations to contribute. The EO Support Sheets outline satellite data requirements, availability and data access, as well as global datasets, platforms and tools available for analysis. A step-by-step -step guide for EO integration into the SDG indicator framework is summarised, alongside recommendations for implementation. Of the 17 SDGs, the CIOS SDG team has focused their initial efforts towards the four SDGs where they believe Earth observations can make the most significant impact. SDG 6 is titled Clean Water and Sanitation, and CIOS has focused on Target 6.6 .6 by providing support for the indicator on change of water-related ecosystems. In partnership with Geo Wetlands, Geo AquaWatch and Geo Glows, Global Water Sustainability, CIOS has been working on a technical report that addresses how satellite data can be used to report on this indicator. The UN Environment Program and Ramsar are the joint custodian agencies for this indicator, and CIOS has reviewed their monitoring methodologies as a basis to identify areas of use and better uptake of satellite observations within current methodologies. SDG 11 focuses on sustainable cities and communities, with CIOS focusing on target 11.3, providing support for the land consumption and population growth indicator. In March 2022, the team published the EO support sheet for this indicator. CIOS also contributed to the launch of the GEO EO toolkit for sustainable cities and human settlements, and developed the degree of urbanisation as a method to delineate cities, urban and rural areas, as approved by the UN Statistical Commission for International Comparison. The CIOS Coastal Observations Applications Services and Tools, or COAST, ad hoc team leads the CIOS effort for SDG 14, Life Below Water. Focusing on target 14.1 and specifically measuring coastal eutrophication in support of the related indicator, COAST partners with GeoBlue Planet and GeoAquawatch and is working on cross CIOS connections with the Ocean Colour Radiometry Virtual Constellation to discuss emerging approaches and solutions for global, regional and national needs of merged and gap-free coastal ocean colour products at highest possible spatial resolutions. CIOS Coast, with support from the SDG team, produced Chlorophyll A concentration datasets, which were included in the 2021 SDG report. For SDG 15, titled Life on Land, CIOS focuses their efforts towards target 15.3, providing support for measuring the extent of land degradation using Earth observation. In 2021, CIOS provided updated satellite dataset recommendations, consistent with the UN Convention to Combat Desertification's Good Practice Guidance Reports, referencing the CIOS Analysis Ready Data Framework. CIOS is also working closely with the Geo Land Degradation Neutrality Initiative to find options to address some of the emerging data and analytics needs for this indicator that were identified during the recent SDG reporting processes. In August 2022, CIOS published the Earth Observation Support Sheet for this indicator to provide more information to end users. Beyond the SDG team, CIOS also works closely with the Global Forest Observations Initiative, providing support for the indicator monitoring sustainable forest management, with the aim to provide countries with wall-to-wall -wall national coverage of satellite data. CIOS agencies have committed to providing global annual coverage of the world's forests to ensure that countries have the minimum data necessary to participate in frameworks focused on sustaining forest cover. 
SDG 2 calls for zero hunger and Earth Observations can help achieve this by the production of timely agricultural yield and market information, supporting the effort to limit extreme food price volatility. While the SDG team is not directly involved with SDG 2, CELS provides support to GeoGlam, the Group on Earth Observations Global Agricultural Monitoring Initiative, through the LSIVC GeoGlam subgroup, and is exploring ways to support SDG2. GeoGlam hosts Crop Monitor, which provides open, timely, and science-driven information on crop conditions in support of market transparency and early warning of production shortfalls. To learn more about CELS activities in support of the Sustainable Development Goals, visit ceos.org forward slash SDG.